box from Cody. This is an MS8 box. Um, we're on Wi-Fi right now, as you can see. Um, you can also plug it into Ethernet. You'd have a better connection to the Internet. You'd probably stream a lot better, but for right now we're on Wi-Fi. This is a 5 gigahertz connection. So it runs Android KitKat 4.4. You can download any of the apps from the Google Play Store, anything that you can put on your phone or on a tablet, you can run on the TV. Acts as a smart TV. We have Sonos for our wireless speakers in the house. Uh, this is an IP camera system. Uh, you can add just about anything that you want. Netflix. Um, you can add uh, VoIP or Tango or any kind of FaceTime kind of app. Anyways, we're going to look at Cody. So here is Cody. Um, everything is organized as to movies, sports, TV shows, everything it comes under a header and then under each one of them there's a quick selection of channels that offer movies or TV shows or whatever you're looking for. We'll go looking for movies right now. So I'm under the movies, so I'm going to go to this one here. It uh, comes up with a second menu that asks you what type of movies you're looking for. A bunch of selections here. I'm going to choose 2015 movies. And you have a list of movies. There's our new uh, The Martian. I'll give it a try. You can see it's pretty clear, 1080p quality, Dolby Digital 5.1. You can fast forward it as if you were watching a Blu-ray. I don't want to give away too much in the movie, but that's pretty much how it works. Fast forward, rewind. I'm going to try another one. Just randomly stop on one. I don't know what this is. Again, very quick. This one looks like it's a, uh, a screener of sorts. I saw a little bit of. Uh, Asian characters on the top, but usually that, those go away. The history of man is defined by war. Same thing. Fast forward it. Now, if I was looking for something in particular, go to a different channel. And choose search. Uh, whatever you're particularly looking for. Uh, choose. Uh, what am I going to choose? Something easy to spell. How about Pope? Choose Pulp Fiction. It's found us a few different versions of it. it it'll give you several different options. Um, some of these you're going to find are fairly far away. They may not stream very well. Some of them won't stream at all. Uh, you usually have several different options, so if one doesn't, you just try another one. I'd like to watch it in 1080p, so I'm going to try this one first. It's 
seems to be streaming fairly well. Fast forward. No problems. Um, local TV. I found that this channel here, if you go to Phoenix and try Woody Entertainment, Canada TV, you have a bunch of different options. I'll try a Global TV, NBC here. And this is live TV, of course. It's not uh, pre-recorded. This isn't a uh, this isn't a podcast or anything like this. This is live TV. If I wanted sports, I can go into live sports, Canada TV sports. I'll try this. There's all your different TV channels. I'll try TSN. No, it doesn't seem to have anything on it. I'll try this one. Of anything right now, but that's where you go. With new secret outlast extend, you're ready for any epic adventure. Secret's new There's Sportsnet. It's uh, looking a little blocky right now, but uh, that'll change as the uh, internet. Stream gets better. It'll it'll get clearer and clearer. I know how your genetics relate to things like celiac disease, cystic fibrosis. And last, we'll try kids shows. DNA. The more you know about yourself. Back to the main menu. Informational purposes only. Brought to you by Twenty Three and Me. Not a substitute for medical advice. Every day just became Sunday at Subway restaurants. So there's a whole menu full of kids shows. There's also kids movies, kids TV shows. Uh, if we're going to go to the Disney collection here. I haven't tried this. So. But, uh, Toy Story. It's asking whether we want to watch it in high definition or standard definition. And in high definition, we've got two choices, 720p or 1080p. If you're worried about uh, going over your cap with your internet, you can choose 720p. Picture quality on most TVs, you wouldn't notice much of a difference. Pretty clear. And that's about it.